but it's gonna bring you to LA in some capacity. So it's like moving there or just going back and forth? I, I still have <laughs> have it. You'll have the opportunity, I think, to live there. Like, okay. Oh, like, oh, I don't want to ruin Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. You're just the weirdest thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah? I want to see myself. Oh, weird. Hi. Oh, there you go. Oh, thanks. Oh. Okay. Weird. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I love well, you. Oh, thank you. So I know it's a little nerve wracking. It's all good. Yeah. I'll, I'll relay everything that comes through. So Thank you. So this is weird. And the way this is coming across. You can relate to a Grandpa Sam that's passed away. Did he die on Christmas? Yes. Okay. Where's the Jewish connection in the family? We're all Jewish. My dad died a year ago, exactly a year ago, and my grandfather, my Baba Sam, died three, four years ago. Gotcha. That's okay. I'm so sorry for your loss. Thank you. I appreciate it. When he's coming in, he keeps showing me all this symbology over and over again. It's interesting that you mentioned dad passing because he's bringing up another man yes. that would have died. And the way this comes in, it's really... Whew, yeah, it's crazy. If I can get my pen. It's crazy. <clears throat> Weird living room. Weird. Okay, I don't know if this is going to make any sense to you, but I'm just going to relay this. They're having me talk about two sons in the family. I'm just going to say anything, don't say anything quite yet. <laughs> Grandpa's bringing up two sons in the family, but then he's having me bring up his wife. He's putting a living feeling around her in some capacity. So is your grandmother still alive? Yes. Okay, that's all I need. So he's having me bring up her. Okay. But then he's also having me bring up these two sons. His There's brother. A, so were, did your grandfather have two boys? Yes. Okay. One of them's still alive. Right, and that's kind of what I'm My getting. uncle. Gotcha. In the way this is coming across, they're having me talk about uncle having to make a decision about grandma and where she's living, where she's at, her well-being. There's going to be some form of a conversation around this, but around uncle about where grandma is. Did someone celebrate their 90th birthday, or is there like any big 90th celebrations? Uh, my grandfather had his 90th, or I think he was 89. I don't, th I don't think my grandma turned 90 yet. She's in her 80s. Gotcha. I'm okay. Pretty sure. I'm double check with this, but they just okay. are acknowledging like being right on the cusp, and then like 90, 90, 90 in a reference to a celebration around this in some way. Um, are there a bunch of S's in the family? My sister Sherry. Okay. Uh, there's more Sasha, S's. my cousin. There, there, there's more S's. S's, S's. Um, my sister Emily. That's not an S. <laughs> first, first letter S. Yes. What's Grandma's name? Selma. <laughs> <laughs> Can't think of it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's all good. Okay. It happens. I call it psychic amnesia. Okay. Um, it's all good. But please know when this comes through, they're absolutely fine. Grandpa is having me acknowledge for you some actually very exciting career stuff. Oh. And I know Dad obviously passed, and in, in that he was a big priority. But yes. For some Love you, Dad. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> or I don't know why I said. Sorry. <laughs> but please know you are going to have a job opportunity, and I'm seeing Los Angeles. And there's a reference to entrepreneurship, owning your own business, doing your own thing, okay. working in Willing and Dealing, yeah. but it's gonna bring you to LA in some capacity. So that's Like good. moving there or just going back and forth? I, I still <laughs> actually have it. <laughs> You'll have the opportunity, I think, to live there in some capacity. Okay. But I feel like a job thing might might take us in kind of that direction. Are you in a creative field at all? I do video shop and I take photos. Nice, fabulous. So, so Photoshop and video. Okay. That's what I call it. Nice, you can move. Yeah. Well, I really, I'm very excited about your future, and just oh. please keep in mind, when this comes through, it, I, I'm not getting a strong, strong read on dad as much, really? but he's absolutely no doubt around. Sometimes just the strongest communicator will come through, and sometimes it has to do with timing, but please know, they're all together today, and these are messages that I think your family can benefit, especially when it comes time with grandma. There's going to have to be a decision made about where she's at, where she's living, where she's staying. Okay. And that I wasn't fully aware of that. That's, that's interesting. Right, it's okay. going to happen in the future, so it's all good. Oh, it hasn't but, happened yet. But let him know that it's, it's okay with this and that okay. he is around, okay? Okay, I had a very crazy dream about my dad like three months ago. Wow. Um, if you can't tell him, I love him so much. I just oh. want to make him proud. Yeah, everything that I am is because of him and his support, oh, you know, so I, I just hope I can relay that to him. Of course. Well, you know what the beautiful thing about that is, is you <laughs> just need a medium to do that. You can still speak to your dad. You can still have that bond and, and pray to him at night. Talk to him out loud. Talk Go about okay. your day-to-day -day life. Okay. He will be with you. So Love thank you, dad. Thank uh -huh. you. <laughs>
Some readings can be really emotional. Sorry, I like hate you. Others are a little bit resolved.